get enough to do the round pin, the fence, and the shelter. I just unpacked a package from an old friend of mine, Ray, who sent in a package. And I figured I'd repack it a little bit to unpack again later, but just to show you guys what, what he sent. This is the first thing, this sign here. <laughs> I don't like you. I think that's kind of accurate. These bells. Here, I'll pull these out. One-handed, huh? Organic Rainforest Blend Coffee. This smells really good. I imagine I can probably just drop this into a cup of hot water. Uh, let's see, we've got... Zydeco Gator. Tabasco... Habanero sauce. Whew. Might be spicy, huh? And look at this one. <laughs> colon clean, clean, or a colon cleaner. <laughs> I like hot sauce a lot, so I'll definitely let you know what I think about those. Use some bags in here. Uh, this is Wild Life Protection. So this is a Northeast Florida company, if you're out there. Oops. Ginger Chews. I like my ginger. Little container here. Look at this. Beef Jerky. Man, that looks good. I probably have a piece right now. I've got a collar here. This is one of those fly traps that opens up to a big cylinder. And then it has an attachable container here. And you can even get, you can just put water in there or you can put in fly bait. Cookies, Danish butter cookies. Look at this guy, this would be handy you just soak down this rag it probably stays cooler than a normal rag and then you can wear it all kinds of different ways to stay cool in the hot summer heat which would be probably a good idea right now it's over a hundred degrees earplugs love me some earplugs fire starter not for cooking <laughs> and uh bunch of key tags or you could use it for other stuff I, I needed one of these I just barely broke I keep one of these in the shower for my fingernails and stuff and I just broke mine it just broke in half for some reason and last but not least this this is one of those mouse trap bucket lids it's funny because you know I've got cats and they do really great but you can still get some mice with one of these and a buddy of mine was just talking about making a new bucket trap and i've had bucket traps but this is one of the better models that you know it, they made it it's not just diy so sometimes it works better that way so the little mice walk up a stairway and and then they just flap right down into the bucket and i made a my own diy version of the same trap and i caught a bunch of mice but 
the cats really do a good job, but they do miss some mice. So we'll we'll set this up and we'll catch some, I'm sure. 